tale as old as time, song as old as rhyme, beauty on the beast. Oh, hey guys, welcome to a Magic Moment Monday where I'm gonna be sharing something with you that is very near and dear to my heart as I do in all these Magic Moment Mondays. I hope you're enjoying these. The whole point behind them is to really give you a glimpse into my life and the things that make me tick and the things that make me me. Um, and sharing those with you so you can use them however you like. Today's Magic Moment Monday is a little memento that I have that I carry with me at all times, and it is my Disney Mickey Mouse watch. And for those of you that know me, you know how important Disney is to me. And I'll tell you the story, for those of you that don't know, as to why I bought this watch, why Disney is important to me, and why this is our Magic Moment Monday. When I was a kid, my parents used to take me and my, I should say, my brother, my sister, and me to Disney World. And we would go, um, go every other year, and we'd stay in a really nice hotel, and we'd go to the theme parks, and we'd ride on the rides. And only later in life did I learn how expensive that trip was for my parents, and how much they sacrificed to make that trip happen for us. Um, and so it was always a thing that we looked forward to, it was always something that we loved to do, and it was the happiest that I saw my mom and dad as well, seeing how happy we were getting all the autographs and riding all the rides and all that fun stuff. And so it was February of 2015. My business had just started going well. It was three years into the business. Um, and I was with my good friend Giovanni Dubois, who I'll send this video to. Uh, in San Francisco, and I told you about it. I said, hey, I, I'm making enough money where I think that I want to go out and buy a Rolex watch. And he said, that's cool if you want a Rolex watch, but why? Do you think it's because you'll be taken more seriously by your clients? Do you, do you actually like Rolex watches? What is the reason behind why you want the Rolex watch? And I said, actually, I just think it'll give me more credibility. And he said, dude, that's not really you. Why don't you go think about something that's more you? And so I thought about it, and around that time, I had thought to myself, well, what if I used that $7,000 that I was gonna spend on a Rolex watch and actually made a dream of mine come true, which was taking my parents and surprising them on a trip to Disney World. And so I said, you know, I want to do that. And no, actually I'm getting the dates wrong. This was actually like November or December of 2014. And so at that moment, I had bought this Mickey Mouse watch on jcpenny.com for like 30 bucks. And Christmas that year, I surprised them and said, we're going to Disney World in April. Um, and, and that was the, the dream coming true. So the watch for me represents several different things. Number one, the fact that I am so grateful for my parents. Number two, the fact that I set a goal many years before to take my parents to Disney and it required some deep thinking in terms of why did I want this physical thing, this Rolex watch, when the experiences that I was able to create because of this, what this watch represents with my parents and Disney World was unbelievable. And I remember that when I was at Disney World, um, I remember thinking it was one of the best days of my entire life. So, you know, the watch represents the work, represents the persistence, represents the dedication, but more than anything, it represents what I really believe makes life life, which is how can I, as one human being, create as many magical moments for other people as possible? And that's what Disney represents to me. And I think that's what Disney represents to my parents. So this watch every single day reminds me, number one, that dreams really do come true and that's the whole mantra of Disney. Um, and number two, you are in control of making those dreams come true. It just requires a tremendous amount of hard work and a tremendous amount of eye on the prize. And then things just happen, magical moments happen. And uh, that trip to Disney was just one perfect example. So many things happened on that trip from seeing my father move to tears from uh, the piano player playing Beauty and the Beast to for some miraculous reason getting upgraded to this immense, enormous suite so I could stay with my parents. I was gonna go and stay in a local Holiday Inn because I couldn't afford to stay in the hotel they were staying in because I'd spent all the money on, on their trip um, to just bonding with them in, in new ways. So 
for me on this Magic Moment Monday, Mickey and the magic and the Disney and the vision and the joy of my childhood being brought to my parents in a new and unique and beautiful way um, is very special to share with you. Thank you for watching another Magic Moment Monday with me.